this is Minecraft, and we're sneaking through the water. I don't know why. Uh, okay, so hello. Now this is we're gonna consider this episode twelve B because I um well first off let's let's let me explain what's going on. I told you that I would make episode twelve uh, let me turn the thing back on. That I would make episode twelve uh with the shaders mods on. Jeez, my brain is just not working today. So this is it. This is the shaders mod. Um, I think there's a couple other mods involved here. It's from the magic launcher or something or other. Uh, anyways, it adds a. Uh, you'll be able. To oh yeah, look at that. It's nice. It's beautiful. I turn my smooth lighting off because it tends to fuck with the texture pack for some reason. I'm not totally sure why, but it does. Um, alright, let's plant some shit. I'm also using a different mic today than I normally do, so you might hear something that, oop, like that, when I just hit it. <sighs> okay, so uh, this is nighttime, and it's not exactly the best time to show off the shaders mods, but it, it's not a bad time either, because, oh Jesus, hell. Where am I? Okay. Because you can see how uh, during night it turns everything this sort of blue color, which is really nice. Because I don't know if you've ever gone outside at night, but it sort of looks like this. Morning Red Bull. Okay. Uh, the water also, you can see it bouncing along really nice. My only problem with it is from a distance, it becomes a little too busy. I don't know. But you can't complain for for what it is. It looks great. Now you can see the shadows growing as the moon moves across the sky. That is awesome. That that looks great. Now also your normal Minecraft shadow is a circle just underneath you. Your shaders mod Minecraft statue is a rough representation of your actual body shape, which is just fantastic. Now I just I absolutely adore how this looks. The problem is if you don't have a decent gaming setup, and honestly I don't. I just I have a fairly new computer and that's about it. But uh, even I, it, it's really resource heavy, which means that uh, I have to play in a minimized window. I have to turn uh, a few of the settings way down to get it to operate correctly. Now we're just going to watch the moon set here and the sun rise. And it's it's really something to, to see. Absolutely beautiful. But again, if you have a, a computer that's just, you know, not great, you're going to have a bad time. I am pulling, on average, about 20 frames a second right now, which isn't fantastic. I imagine the video will still be sort of smooth. But, um, ooh, I'm down to 13 now. But normally, I'm getting about 60 frames a second. Okay, now everything's darkening because the moonbeams, I guess, aren't hitting here. But the sun's about to come up, and it's going to be so good looking. This is just beautiful to me. Here. Snapshot time. There we go. Oh, okay, so our shadow's behind us, and boom, glare. Now look at the light on, like, the top of the grass. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, if it wasn't so resource-heavy, and you know the problem, uh, Minecraft in general is really resource-heavy. And I heard, I, I don't know shit about programming, but I heard when Minecraft first came out, that's primarily because it runs on Java, or is Java. I don't know shit about programming. Look at this. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, now, 
at the beginning of the video I said that we are going to consider this episode 12B. The reason for that is I recorded a video yesterday, but uh, I was sick and I wasn't doing good. And I was, uh, when I listened back to the audio, I was just mumbling a lot and it, it was bad. Uh, so I didn't really do much in the video. I f deleted it out of rage. Otherwise, I'd show you some clips, I guess. But uh, I didn't really do much. I just showed off the lighting. And uh, I went mining. I started branch mining a little bit. And I got five diamond and some other shit. And I tore through a pickaxe. Now, today, I would like to, uh, I think I'd like to start setting up our house. So let's get some building materials. Uh, let's see. Oh, and I figured out what enchanted books are for. So that's cool. <laughs> uh, projectile protection 3, obviously that's going to go on a chest plate once I get more diamonds. Alright, so what do we want to build first? Let's... We don't need foods. Let's make some uh, stuff. That, that. Chiseled stone bricks. I'm going to save those because I, I know I'm going to want them for something. So, uh, okay. That and that. Um, take that. Uh, let's put those diamonds away before we fucking die and lose them. And we'll take this. Alright, let's go upstairs. What is this, episode 12? Yeah, it's got to be episode 12. Alright, so I'm thinking what I'm going to do is put a TV up here. Or something. Uh, we're going to close this before we get snuck up on. Sneaked up on. And uh, up here, I'm thinking bookshelves. It's gonna. I'm going to need a lot of leather, though. How much leather do I... No, stop that. You don't need to go up and down the stairs a hundred fucking times. Alright. Let's, uh... Let's make a sitting area. <coughs> I wish you could make, a uh, black wool stairs. Ah! No, don't put a sign there. I just want you know a nice area for my guests to sit. My guests on my single pl single player world. <coughs> well, I could have land guests. I uh. I joined in on my son's series. He uh. He's playing as Sinanambi. And uh, well, both my sons. Uh, Best Brownie and Sinanambi. We both have YouTube channels. I don't know how busy they are uploading, but they both have channels, and I would suggest if you're watching this, check them out. I mean, they're younger and their voice are voices are, you know, quite a bit higher, but they have a good time playing, and it's fun to listen to them bicker once in a while. Uh, all right, what was I doing? Well, we got this. I'm thinking I'm going to end up using uh, redstone lamps up there. Uh, first I have to get to the nether though, I suppose. Alright, let's uh, put a nice little table down. Everything's wood. Man, I don't like that. I wish they would introduce paint or something. Okay, and uh, over here we'll put like a jukebox maybe. A stereo. <sighs> I don't know. Let's see if we can go get some leather for books. I'm going to have plenty of paper soon. So, And besides, this is the shaders episode. What, we don't want to spend all day in the mine, do we? Hell no. Okay. Oh, one other thing about the shaders mod that I didn't mention that I should. I mean, I know it's an old mod and you probably have seen it, but... The blocks, the texture pack, has been adjusted so that even the blocks have tiny little shadows. It's really, really neat. 
Now you can't play you can play this texture pack without all the mods loaded. It turns everything in this weird blue and purple color. So I don't know. If you want it to be crazy weird looking, play the texture pack without the mod. Let's find some goddamn cows. Do I have my compass? Yes. Let's keep that right there. Going cow hunting. Yes, that's what they get. Now, it should also be known that right now I have my brightness set on moody. <laughs> It gets real bright. Is that a cow? Yep, those are cows if I ever saw them. Alright. I don't know if you can hear it. I have my volume way down. It tends to be pretty overpowering, so I don't know if you can hear me walking around and whatnot. One leather so far. Give me your leather. What I should be doing is farming and breeding, but, you know. Apparently that's too difficult for me. I'll just kill everything until there's nothing left and I have to travel ten miles to start my animal farm. <coughs> On the bright side though, plenty of XP. Ugh, goddamn ice. <laughs> Come on, where the hell are you going, you son of a bitch? Look at this ice, too. This is just... It's reflective. It is awesome. Actually, I think that's snow. But, uh... I'll sh the I there was another cow. Where'd he go? But still, super reflective snow. Which, uh... Is semi-realistic. Alright, here's ice. Right here. Not reflective, now that I look at it. Whatever. Alright. Uh, we got... S four leather. Still not really enough to start a bookshelves. Oh, there's some more leather. Now we got six leather. I'd like to keep a journal too, so I'm gonna have to get some ink and all that good stuff. See, it's difficult when you play a world in little 20 minute bursts because you don't want to get involved in a big project and play for seven hours and fill your hard drive to the brim with fraps videos. Is there a cloud over me? Yeah, apparently. Uh, and then have to cut it up later and take six days to upload videos to YouTube. Come on, cow. So I don't know, I mean, if you like the shaders look, I guess I can continue the world with it. If not, I'm just going to end up going back to the normal look of my videos. And you know. With the Sfax textures. And there's cows everywhere. I don't know what I'm so worried about. This guy. I'm bound in for him. Get out of here. Get out of here. Alright, let's go make some bookshelves. We're going to need them for our enchantment table soon anyway. So I just got really nervous. I realized I hadn't eaten in a while. I looked down, I still have full health. So that's cool. We might want to cover up this chasm too. It's right here, here. and This is where our animals are going to be. Might have to start thinking about that. Into the jungle, bounding and leaping and jumping and stuff. Alright, I, I I don't know. So I, if the video comes out smooth, maybe I will just use shaders from now on. Depends. Let me know what you think. We'll just dump a bunch of shit in here for now. Alright, let's make some books. What do I have for reeds? Because we want all the reeds we can get. We want all the leather we can get. Um, Alright. Now, let's see. Reeds. One, two, three. One. Well, that didn't work out well.
All right, we got 39 paper. Now, how two, three, right? And then a leather. Yes. All right. Actually, it looks like it's paper we need most. We have 13 books. Then I believe we do this. Alright, we need more wood. Shit. Wood. Shit, shit. I have an axe. Let's go with some wood. God damn it. Oh good, it's night time. And as you can see, dark as fuck out here. Ugh. Okay, let's chop this tree down. Yeah, I hear a tree. Look at the, the leaves wobbling in the breeze, like they own the place. Alright, there's some wood. Let's get back inside before the darkness swallows us. Make some bookshelves. Bookshelves, bookshelves is what I like to make. Bookshelves, bookshelves is what I like to make. Okay. There was no, uh, <laughs> I don't know why I did it like that. Don't ask questions. Alright. So now we got four bookshelves. What we need is some obsidian. So that way we can drop an enchantment table down and all that. So we're not even going to use these bookshelves up here. We're going to start working on our enchanting area. Where should that be? In here? No, it's got to be a block away, I think. We'll do fuck, we'll do it right here. Okay. So, uh 1 2 3 4, I guess. Yeah, see, it looks like kind of what you would have down in your basement anyway, I guess. So, yeah, basically with the enchant thing, we're going to bring these out to, like, here. And then we're going to go one more row here and come out. And then we're going to stack them all up this height and drop the enchantment table here, I believe, once we get obsidian. I don't have any, do I? I don't think so, because I don't think I've made a diamond pickaxe. No. Okay. That's next episode. We're going to hunt for obsidian. This has been the Shaders mod. I don't know if I'm going to end up using it again for the next episode because it gets so crazy dark. I've been Cold Purple Thumb. This is Minecraft. I'll see you next time for episode 13. Adios, kids. <laughs>